What are you doing with your life? I remember before I started a business, I had no freedom, no flexibility, wasn't in control of my life, wasn't in control of my income, asking for a raise, asking for time off. Remember, I went to lunch, five minutes late, I came back. Boss said, what are you doing? I'm gonna dock your pay. Five minutes late, no control. What are you doing with your life? You're sitting around, you're saying, I don't know what to do. I don't have control, I don't get to do what I wanna do. I mean, I look like this in the middle of the day, I run a business, I'm making money. I can go take a long lunch if I want to. Freedom, there is freedom in owning your own stuff, whatever that looks like. Maybe it's not starting a business, maybe it's working a job that has more flexibility than eight to five. I don't know, but you gotta figure something out. What are you doing? What are you doing in life? Figure it out. Stop waiting around for things to happen to you. Remember, I used to wait and say, well, if I get great grades in college and I get my resume good, someone's gonna come in and write me a big check. Only time I got a big check is when I started my own business. Only time I cash big checks is when I work for myself. No one is gonna pay you more than they could pay somebody else. If they can replace you for half your salary, be ready, they're gonna replace you. If you're a winner, you shouldn't be worried. You should be worried. You gotta be a killer in this world. You gotta be uh, an elite performer in whatever field you're at. You gotta be the top of the top and you're still gonna get underpaid. You will be underpaid your entire life unless you start a business. You get paid exactly what you're worth as a business, as a business owner. If you don't produce, you don't make money. But let me tell you, if you do produce, you make tons of money. If people got nice watches, they got nice watches, but it tells them when they need to get back to work, when they need to get back from lunch, they ain't got no freedom. You might as well sell that watch and at least have some money in the bank so if something goes south, like your boss fires you at any moment, better to have that cash than have that watch. So you need to figure out in life, what are you doing? Figure it out, it's the most important thing you need to figure out. And I'm not saying, hey, everybody should go start a business. But what I am saying is everybody deserves to have freedom in this world. And if you don't have freedom in your job, some of you guys may think you do, that's fine, whatever. But if you don't have freedom, you need to find a way to get it. Because you got one life, if you're gonna be in shackles for 40 years, working for somebody else, and then right when you're broke and bent over, you can take vacations at 65, falling asleep in Italy on the gondola. I saw a picture of a bunch of old people they're taking a vacation in Italy, falling asleep on the gondola. You know why they're falling asleep? Because they didn't travel early in life, because they didn't have the freedom. They worked for somebody else for their good years, and then at the end of their life, when they had broken knees, broken backs, that's when they take their vacation. Take your vacations now. Take a grip on your life. Stop sitting around and accepting where you're at. So many people, well, I got a good job. It, you know, they, they take care of me, good benefits. Uh, it's like, no. You're accepting what they're giving you to give up on your dreams. You're accepting the consistent paycheck, the stability to give up on your dreams. That's okay, you can do that. It's not extraordinary though. And I'm sick and tired of hearing people, well, you know, I, I, I think that's for other people, like so-and-so got it lucky. Ain't nobody got lucky in this world. You still gotta show up. Even if your mommy and daddy gave you a trust fund, you still got to be alive and take the money. You gotta do something. Now, everyone's life's a little bit harder than everybody else's, but you gotta do something. You gotta do something with your life. Would you follow your money or your passion? That's a great question. You know what I would do? I would follow the money. Follow opportunity. Opportunity is always there. Passion comes and goes. I would rather make money to fuel my passion. If I love boating, great. I'm gonna make a ton of money so I can buy whatever boat I want, so I can boat whenever I want. You gotta find out what you're doing in this world. What are you doing? Figure it out. Take action. 
If you don't know what you want to do in this world, take action, try to figure it out. Figure out who you need to meet with, who do you need to sit down with, who needs to ask you some questions that you need to get thinking about what you need to do in life. You need to take action. So many people, they're like, well, I'm trying to figure out what I want to do. When's the last time you talked to somebody? When's the last time you got somebody lunch? When's the last time that you actually evaluated, looked up stuff, take courses, looked up stuff on YouTube, how to start a business? Where's an opportunity in business right now? Where's an opportunity for me to get out of the current job I'm in and go work somewhere else? There is so much freedom in this world, it's insane, but everybody thinks that they're in, that they're chained up. You're not chained up in any sense in the United States of America. I don't know about other places in the world, but if you're in the United States of America, you have so much freedom, so much opportunity in this country, but what you've done is you've taken the consistency and you've settled. When you settle, you're saying, hey, my dreams are not mine anymore. They are just a thought that was a thought before and they don't exist anymore. Stop settling. When you settle, there is nothing exciting about life. You go through your daily grudging job and there's nothing exciting about settling. Dreaming, dreaming big excites you. It gets you out of bed. It gets you to, to go to heights. You know, when somebody goes through a, you ever seen somebody going through a big weight loss journey and they're saying, hey, you know, I have been eating this and then they're laser focused because they have a dream of what they want to be, what they want to look like. That person's motivated. It's the same thing in your life. You got to have big dreams that get you out of bed, get you going. But like, man, I tell you what, when I, when I started my own business and where we're at now, I mean, we're able to travel the world. We've been to Paris. We're going to London. We're going to Canada. I've been to New York. Where else we've been? Where else we've been? Vegas. Vegas. We went to Las Vegas, Florida. LA, Florida. That's freedom. We've gone to seven to eight different places in the last year. I could not work for somebody else and ask for vacation time for that. They would say, sir, you've taken three months off, you're fired. So if you want freedom, you wanna travel, you wanna go do fun stuff, you gotta find a way to make a lot of money and you gotta find a way to work for yourself so you don't gotta ask for that vacation time. So what are you doing with your life? Figure it out, get to the bottom of it, so you can start living a fulfilled life.